So what are currently the major deal breakers for electric transportation, also for electric airplanes? It's uh, limited energy density, limited battery lifetime, high costs and limited safety. I'm Stefan Rohr, I'm the co-founder of SIPLab and we address all these problems a little bit more, a little bit less. So what is the deal? Our customers are the battery manufacturers, so they have the need, they, they have to decide what are the guarantees for their batteries, for example. Um, what cells should they choose for the battery system? How should they design their battery systems? What lifetime could they expect for the battery system? How should they operate them? Therefore, SIPLAB delivers the thematic unit and a digital battery twin as software as service. I will elaborate on that later. Therefore, SIPLAB receives around 60 euros per battery per year. So how does the market look like? So we just focus on la uh, large vehicle batteries. So we talk about multiple cell batteries. For example, Tesla Model S has around 80,000 cells in one battery system. There are currently around 3 million globally. We can break it down th uh, to 560,000 in Europe. And we focus on our beach market, market, industrial vehicles, um, because they are highly operated in fleets. So you have a great risk allocation you have a high cost share of batteries and we have existing contacts and letter of intents, which yield for SIPLED to 20 million uh, euro in contract potential. To understand the customer value proposition, we have to start from the bottom right corner. Um, currently, it's like the battery manufacturer, they do try and error. Uh, with SIPLAB, we enable a better and faster product development process. We avoid the testing because we currently know the state of health of the batteries and the future outcome. We substitute uh, or we avoid the warranty claims, so currently battery manufacturers are driving against the wall. And we enable a longer and safer battery life and we avoid a disposal. So we make economic second life possible. That sums up to 1,500 euro per battery in cost reduction. On the right side you can see for example BMW i3 battery and our software where we can see the state of health of each battery cell and also can predict that. So how does the product look like? It's very technical. Um, actually, there are, main, uh, there are three major building blocks. We have the battery model, which represents electric thermal aging model of the battery system. We, we build that in battery lab. And uh, we take one part of the algorithms, bring it on our telematics unit, plug it to the battery, to, to the bread da uh, data pre-processing, send the data to our back end. Then it comes together with the battery model, which we implemented, and we have this real digital battery twin. So it acts like the real system, it behaves like the real system, it can look into the future, how will the uh, system look like in the future, and it can derive um, uh, optimization potential. And it's visualized to the customer. How um, are the financials? So we are um, expecting around 480 or nearly 500 euros profit per battery, which over the eight years, it's around 60 euros per battery per year. And we really want to reach out for a very high market share, which yields in 2020 to 1.8 million in, in profit potential and 44 in contract potential. So the key value drivers are, of course, the life cycle value of the, which we gain, um, bring to the customers and the number of batteries which we are um, building the digital twin for. To understand the climate impact, we just focus on the right um, picture. So it's a lithium mine. Um, we have to understand that batteries contain lithium, manganese, cobalt, and so on. Through a longer life and economic second life, we reduce the uh, CO2 emission around 50% to 76,000 tons in our beachhead market. We have competitors, um, or when we look at the competitors' landscape, we are testing companies, IT infrastructure, monitoring companies, and there is in house development, but we focus on small and medium sized companies, combine it to a software as service model, and we have a great battery network effect, which um, um, brings me to the end. <laughs> so the team is a dream. Um, with Michael on the left side, he, um, we know each other around four years. We um, worked together during our PhD topic. He developed the technology in his PhD thesis. We have Paula. She um, did the economic visibility study in her master thesis. And I'm, I'm more or less the doer. I do the product development close to the customer and the, uh, the business development. And our great vision is not just for batteries to make digital product twins get common to save resources and optimize the life cycle. Thank you very much. Yeah.